Welcome to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we get to go do a bunch of Team Rocket stuff. Sounds fun. It sounds not really all that fun to me. But before we get going, um, need to talk about some things first. First of all, um, you may have noticed like the volume and stuff in the last few episodes being kind of wonky, so on and so forth. That's just me trying shit. Um, honestly, it, this all this stuff is new to me, so I just kind of stick around with you know the tools that I have just to see what does what and see how it sounds and stuff I'm not stupid I'm not you know screwing shit up on purpose and I'm not that lazy I'm just trying new shit you may have seen something happen with the um uh the layout at some point too so yeah I did change that and speaking of the layout um Phyllis is still on there and I'm gonna keep her on there until we get an actual replacement in fact, I may even go grab Phyllis before we get going. Anyway, um, also some general announcements. Um, if you've been watching and you notice that I haven't played or updated Fear in a long, long time, that's because I'm waiting until I get the fucking mouse issue figured out. I'm just going to say fuck it and fix it, I think, and that's going to be a little while before I get around to that. Um, the reason being is because, you know, school just started up this month and I'm kind of trying to work out how much time I really have So I don't really want to get into like three or four LPs all at once and just kind of get lost in it So anyway, that's that. I'll pick it up at some point. I also got a couple other things that um, That are kind of in the works that, you know, then just I just need some time to get all that figured out because I'm not sure like I said I got like two or three things actually that I want to do and I've also been toying with the idea of starting up like a Rome LP or Rome Total War 2 but I'm not sure once again how much time I'll have once I do get fear going again and other stuff that I have in the works in the pipeline so to speak but anyway that's that and I think that's everything but we'll just go ahead and do a little bit of a party update we've got Hellas up here at 25 with a relaxed nature which raises defense and lower speeders is kind of all right it's, it's only got confused ray ice shard surf and body slam now i believe at 28 or somewhere about um it uh it will learn ice beam so once that happens we'll do that all right tauros here our wreckage has a docile nature and he's what level 26 yeah um He's well, kind of well-rounded. Um, anger point is his ability. I did put the silk, silk scarf. I almost called it the self scarf. The self, self, silk scarf. Holy shit, that's tough to say. I put that on him for basically horn attack. Um, it is a stab move with the self, self. God, I can't fucking do it. Jesus, silk scarf. Yeah, there we go. It uh, that that yeah makes his horn attack better and you should learn zen headbutt like at 29 or something like that we do have kenya in the party kenya don't count because we just used that to fucking fly to somewhere then now we're here um we have cray cray oh everybody loves a cray cray also with a docile nature which means he's pretty much even all the way around but he is a bit of a attack and defense pokemon so he's he's pretty much rocking that he's got shell armor which i like a lot and I did give him the quick claw because he is slow and it has come in handy a couple times. Um, he's got Metal Claw right now, Harden, Stomp, and Bubble Beam. Not really sure what the fuck I'm going to do with him in terms of moves. But now we've got Ellie, the fucking monster that is Ellie with a impish nature. Which has yeah, the increase in defense and the decrease in special attack, which is fine. Because we've got the wing attack, which is basically rocking 90 power because of Technician that you see there in the corner. Don't have a good item for her yet, but she is the shit. Um, we should learn like X attack or something here soon. Well, like within the next 20 levels, I guess. I don't know. Something like that. But pursuit and false swipe has come in handy in catching things, but we're not going to really catch anything from here on out. So probably the next move that I get that's halfway decent is going to get rid of false swipe. Anyway, now we've got Pele with a timid nature. Oh, he's so timid. He does. He has yet to evolve. I did mention a couple episodes back that I was going to try and evolve him. But, I, like I said, I got him, I think I said this, I don't know, it's been a while. Um, I got him up to level 35, and he learned Lava Plume, which was awesome. So, he's he's good to go. 
he has the increase in speed and the decrease in attack because of his timid nature, which is all right. Um, and which which is why I'm gonna I think I'm gonna keep Swift on him because Swift is a special attacking move and he has a special attack, you know, guru or whatever you want to fuck call it. But he has Blaze his ability, and I'm not really into that. I guess I mean it's not one of those abilities that I really think about, you know, using. But I am gonna go dig Phyllis out of here real quick. Because we're not really going to go anywhere. We're not going to really need anyone to fly any ha anywhere. Because we got to do a bunch of stuff here in... What the hell is this town? Mahogany? Is that where we're at? I am I am a little disappointed that I'm not... Well, I shouldn't say this. That I'm not going to use Phyllis. But like I said, just looking at it, I've... I'm, I'm dissatisfied with the moves that we can teach it in this, in this LP. So, hence why I'm going to sadly abandon it. Um... Typically, I'm not, yeah, there's that little funky ass tree. Typically, I'm not that sort of person who just gives up on shit like that, but it's just one of those things where you, we're gonna have to, I think, for the sake of the LP, which sucks, but, you know, it, it is, it is what it is, I suppose, right? And now we've got some, some, um, some battles here. Um, oh, uh, I, I probably should have mentioned this when I started recording. I'm recording a couple days early because... Honestly, I, I've had some really bad, bad, bad headaches, migraines, whatever you want to fucking call them this week. And they've been kicking my ass. And today I feel really, really good. So I'm going to take advantage of this and try and get a head start on some of my recording that I usually save for Sundays. You know, hence, like, announcements and shit are, like, two weeks late, as they have been. I mean, it's been a while since I've done the Fear episode, and, and I'm not sure if I said anything about it, but... It, I can't remember. It's been so far, so far, so long ago that I, I, I stopped that and started recording other shit. But anyway, um, I I uh, I just got fed up with the whole mouse situation. The thing that I the fix that I tried to w use wasn't working enough well enough for me, and it was irritating me, and I was getting mad. And I don't want to be an asshole sitting here, you know, just mad all the time and pissed off and playing a game like shit. And that you know, and so. Therefore, to avoid the unwanted tension, I try to stay in high spirits and shit like that when I play this game. I mean, obviously, I get upset, but damn, we're faster than a Sand Slash. Holy shit. But, um, we are seven levels higher than it. But anyhow, um, you know, that's just kind of where we are with this right now. Um, I think today, I think we're going to get up to the lake and battle these bitches. And then once we get there, we're going to stop and then I'll do like the Gyarados thing next thing. Next thing? Next episode. I think that's the plan. I have I have a plan set in motion. We can't go in there. We gotta go this way. We can go the round the boot way. Hey kid, why don't you battle me, you little? Isn't aren't these like little Pokemon Rangers or some shit like that? Lake of Rage. But anyhow, um, yeah. So yeah, yeah, lots of cool shit coming up. I, I think on the channel. I mean, it's gonna be probably gonna be another month or two before anything. Probably at least another month, I think, before something other than Pokemon is updated. Um, I'm not going to update anything daily, um, with the exception of Pokemon. Pokemon is going to be that daily up update. Everything else will be one of those things that's kind of here. Well, not really here and there, but I'll try and set a schedule where it's two or three episodes a week, I think. Um, I know in the early going, I did, you know, Fear plus Enemy Front plus, you know, Pokemon. But, you know, I wasn't in school then, and... Now, I'm in school because it's fall-ish, sort of. Oh, God. No, I don't want to be your friend. Don't be here pressure me into it. She did it again. Man, they, I swear to God, they make me press the X button. I'm just saying that. But anyhow, um... Oh, there was something I wanted to say. I can't remember what it is now. But anyhow, ooh, a Flappy. We want to stay the hell away from that thing. Mm-mm, Lapras. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know what I was going to say. I was going to say something. I had something smart to say. Something actually relevant to what was going on. Not just on the channel, but other stuff in general. But anyway, I, I can't remember what it is now. You know, what's funny is I fucking, you know, bought myself a, um, a, uh, fuck, uh, like a little notebook to write all this shit down. And, um... Yeah, I don't, I don't use it. I wrote all the stuff down for like the um, when I'm when I'm editing all the shit, all the numbers, so I, you know, I I know, you know, what size everything needs to be and shit like that. 
for the videos in the arena, we'll, we'll keep battling and hit another surf. Hit this fucker with another surf. But, um... Yeah, that, that's that's pretty much what I use it for. I bought it specifically to take notes, you know, so that while I'm doing this shit, or if there's something I need to say, I can write all that shit down, I still haven't fucking done that. <laughs> but anyway, I mean, I guess, I guess it is what it is. But anyhow. Um... Oh my god, oh my god, more of this. Do I know Bill? No, I don't know Bill. He's a Clefairy, I mean, it, yeah. You you know it, you know that joke. Oh, I don't even know why I say yes to all this shit. I just, I just get pure person into it, and I feel like an asshole when I say no. I mean, I do, I feel like this isn't the way the game should be. You should be saying yes. What's up, guy? What you looking at? You looking at my Lapras' ass? See how it is. You can just, just gonna, hey! Hey, hey, look at me. I love Pokemon. Yeah, anyway. Um, oh, oh, now I remember what I was going to say. Um, this last week, the girlfriend and I have started playing Pokemon Zeta. Now, if you don't know what that is. Um, ooh, should I confuse Rayet? I'm going to confuse Rayet first. And, because Slowbro frightens me. I don't think we can hit it with the water move. How about you? He's gonna use confusion. Of course he's gonna use confusion. We'll use confuse Ray, and I won't confuse him, but he'll use confusion and it'll hit us. But anyway, um, the girlfriend and I have been playing um, Pokemon Zeta. Now, if you don't know what that is, um, I strongly recommend you go check it out. It is a um, it is a fan-made Pokemon game, basically. It's it's not on an emulator. Or not on an emulator, but it, it is in itself a um, standalone. You don't need an emulator for it. You can just go download it straight from the site. I mean, literally, just go into Google or whatever you want and type in Pokemon Zeta or Omicron. They have two versions of it, you know. Same thing as red and blue and all that good shit. Um, damn, we're tearing this guy up. But anyhow, um, it's it's pretty cool. For a fan made RPG, it's in beta, and I want to say it's like 85 or 90% done or something like that, they said. But I mean, it's 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 a fun game. I mean, they, they do some things a little, uh, not really a little differently. I mean, it's still a Pokemon game, you know what I mean? But it, it they just added some little tweaks and stuff like that. I mean, there's, you know, like like your rival's just some little prick who just says he has all this YOLO swag and all this stuff like that. Just little pop culture references and shit like that in it, which is pretty funny. Um, makes the game a bit more enjoyable. It's a little more adult in that, in, in that aspect. They also have like this fucking Poke Hadron Collider. Yeah, it's it's badass. I, I I I was I was like, oh, that's fucking cool as shit. So um, you know, like I said, go go give it a try. It's free. You don't have to fucking pay for it. It comes without any ads or anything like that. It's really it's really cut and clean and, and easy. You don't have to patch anything. Just go and download it and you know, unzip it basically and just run the damn application. It's pretty much just like. It's it's really cool because ooh Paris song. I don't want to keep old moves because I don't really care for Paris song that much. Yeah, it's it's cool as hell, but I don't know, it doesn't hit very much. But anyway, like I said, just go go give it a try, especially if you're into shit like this. I will play it on the channel at some point. Um, however, <laughs> because of my keyboard, it's eh, my keyboard makes playing that game a little weird. Cause it, whoa, and also what's weird, I don't I don't I can't get my controller to work on that. Um, Pokemon Zeta right now, so I have to use the keyboard, which is kind of weird, but I mean it's it's pretty simplified, and you know they they do a good job of mapping the keys out pretty easily, so it's not it's not that hard to to get used to. It's just my keyboard, since it's kind of like a mini keyboard thing, because it's wireless and all that good shit in my living room and all that wonderful stuff. Um, it it has like all the arrow keys mashed together in the one button and it makes it kind of hard to to use as as directional buttons um for a pokemon game so once i get that like i said that once i get i'll just go buy another fucking keyboard i've been wanting a different one for a while anyway but once i get one then you know i may end up doing that at some point Ooh, gyarados yeah we're gonna switchy switch we're gonna switchy switch who has oh shit Shit, shit, shit. What do we got for this guy? We have no rock. Fuck it. Our best shot is Hellas here, I think, with Ice Shark. See what I did there? 
but he cuts my attack, so that'll not do as much damage as it should. But anyhow, um, and one thing that's really cool about Omicron and Tate, at least in my opinion, it's a hell of a lot harder than these normal games. And I don't like that thrash. That's fucking bullshit. So I'm gonna hit you with a fucking stab, sir, and see how that fucking works. It's that special attack, and oh, motherfucker. I want to say thrash. Oh yeah, good. No, this is thrash normal or fighting? I don't remember. I don't remember. Get out of here. Ain't nobody love you, Gyarados. How many more did you get? Is that is that the only? One? He's got a magic heart. We're gonna switch. We're gonna switchy switchy. Let's go to Cray Cray. I want to go to Cray Cray real quick. See see if Cray Cray can get some easy XP. Oh yeah, it's the only one. Probably should have used Magic Heart or Cray Cray for that, for that Gyarados. But oh well. Oh well, oh well, oh well. Um, oh, also, I was thinking about maybe doing um, uh, some uh, like I know a lot of people do this out there and do like a uh, Pokemon um, TCG, uh, you know, pack openings and elite box openings, and I might do some shit like that. Obviously, I I don't I honestly don't even have a camera. I do not even have a fucking webcam or anything for my PC. I've never gotten into that shit. Hence why you haven't seen my face. Plus, I believe that the government can spy on you. But that's just, that's just, I have no idea what's in this corner. I'm just going this way, by the way. Oh, Pidgeotto. It's so cute. It's so cute. It's so cute. But anyhow, um, I may do shit like that at some point on the channel. Um, I've always liked the card game and stuff, and yeah, I've talked about it a little bit here and there. Alright, this is not what I want it to be. We gotta go talk to it. Do we have to come around this way and jump into the water to go see the fucking Gyarados? I don't remember. I, I want to say we do. I could be wrong. I mean, why else would they fucking have that there if you can just fucking hop on the water from over here where Lancey Boy is? But anyhow, um... Yeah, I, I might do something like that later in the future, you know, get in the habit of playing shit like that, or playing shit like that, doing videos and shit like that, but that's just something to look ahead to. I do have some MMO shit in the works coming up. Is this, is this where I can fishing guru's house? Hey, let's go get another rod, because we all need more rods, ha 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 ha. Like that. Anyhow, oh, okay, alright, fuck you, fishing guru. You ain't got shit for me, ain't nobody love you, anyhow. Do I have to fight you? Nope. Not about you, old guy. The Garados are angry! Ah. That's pretty much what he's just said to me, right? Uh, 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 um. Oh. Um. Do I need. Oh, you don't tell me I had to go. I did. God damn it. I had to go do the thing in the town. That's what I had to go do. Or did I have to go in the fucking thing? I don't remember. Oh, let's go figure it out. Let's go figure it out. Do -do 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 -do. I don't know what I'm fucking doing here. I thought we had to just walk up there and Lance is gonna be like, Oh shit, son, let's go do this. And you're like, alright, bro. Uh-oh. 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 Did I just really pay a thousand? Oh well. Not like we used the money anyhow. Alright, I got a max out of That's good to know, right? Alright, anyhow, let's jump off of here and go this way and... Do we have to go do something with the... I, I'm pretty sure it's in one of these stupid, um... One of the houses we were supposed to visit. Most likely the one with a giant antenna sticking out of the tree. That sounds appropriate, doesn't it? I think it's like the only other house. Oh, yeah, it is, isn't it? You gotta go in here, and the last is like, ah, or do we have to talk to this guy? Oh, that's just me whistling. Why don't you buy something? What did you get, son? What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? Nothing. Hmm. Oh. Yep. That guy. I have to talk to you. 
So now we have like taking here like a race saying right away is being transmitted. Who is the owner? I don't know, Jesus? Shit. I know it's in one of these houses or something, right? Am I, am I crazy? Am I am I out of my mind? Am I am I out of my mind? I must be, I'd say yeah, alright. I must be out of my mind. I know this guy does the rage candy bar thing, right? Right? Mahogany Town, you should try Yummy Rage Candy Bar. I'm not gonna just 300, yeah, whatever. 300 bucks for a Rage Candy Bar. Mm hmm. Yep, 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 yep. Heh. <laughs> now, this is where he's like, hey, I'll. Oh, oh. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And uh, she slow down and enjoy sightseeing. All right, anyhow, that's fucking weird that he just said that though. Do 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 we? Did I fucking screw something up? Oh, because we did that. Did we not do that? I mean, am I am I crazy? Am I crazy? And we just didn't do the whole lighthouse and the pharmacy thing. I mean, we went all the way out to whatever the hell it's called. You know what I'm talking about? That one place with the guy. And the thing, this is gonna be a long episode, I apologize. I, I intended this to be kind of short and sweet and to the point, and here we are. Fucking, it's gonna be a while. Sorry, sorry, I just wanna get to a certain spot and just say, we got it, we're good. We're just, you know, just get it done, but whatever. Um, Let's go this way. You gotta go around here, and now we we did talk to at least we did at least talk to the guy that said there was somebody walking back and forth in a cape. And if he's not here, I gotta figure out what the hell I didn't do, cause he should be up here, right? He should be standing right there. Do we have to go do the red Gyarados? I guess we have to actually fight it. Well, anyhow. Okay, that was fucking cool. Anyhow, I guess we were just supposed to, I thought we were supposed to see him up here. Am I crazy? Am I absolutely crazy? I mean, I don't know. I mean, I know it's been a while since I've done this, but I mean, the Red Gardus is there, obviously. You know, we were going to do that next episode anyhow, but I suppose we'll just, you know, do that after we're done. We're done saving here, and, you know, in the next episode and all that good shit. But anyhow... You made it this far on YouTube, you know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching, and remember, the ghost key is the only place where pants are optional.